and welcome to Ask My Mac, a show for new Mac users who have made the leap from Windows or who are thinking of switching. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is put your iMac face down on a nice flat surface. Uh, I protected mine with a towel, nice and soft. Get yourself a Phillips screwdriver and remove the screw from the bottom. You'll find that it feels like it's stripped, but it's not. That just means that the screw is undone. So once you feel that, you know it's it's uh, out. Um, the problem now is the little cover is a little hard to get off, so you might need a uh, knife to pop it open from the top and then hang on to that and pop it out from the sides. Once you have that out, uh, the little plastic pad, grab firmly with two hands and pull it until you feel the ram pop out. Now at this point, uh, my fingers are a little large, so it's hard to get the ram out. Um, so I slid my iMac to the edge of the table, and once I got my fingers in there, the ram slid out with no troubles whatsoever. Okay, so now we're ready to put our RAM in. Uh, pretty easy to figure out which way it goes. Just look in the hole and you'll see where the little tab needs to go. Grab your iMac firmly when doing this from the top and push in with your thumbs. You will have to give it a little bit of force, but uh, you will feel when it goes in. You'll have a little, not a snap, but you'll, you'll feel it. So do that nice and firmly. Uh, and once that's in, put the tab, little plastic tab back in, fold it under. And then you can move on and uh, do the same with your second sticker frame. Once you've finished putting your RAM in, now it's just a simple putting your cover back on. Snaps in pretty easy. Replace the screw nice and tight. And once that's done, you know, put your iMac back to its original position. Fire it up and uh, hopefully you've got 4 gigs of RAM. So, let's have a look. My iMac is now booting, and to save time, um, I'm now just going into do a screen capture into uh, both my Mac, and there you see it, four gigs of RAM. 